I'll look into some movies, bro. And some like old ass fucking shit movies that we can give our commentary on. <laughs> Night of the Living Dead. It's public domain. Hey, isn't that the movie by George Romero? Actually, that would be a good movie because that was the first zombie movie, so we can just compare those zombies to new ones. Or something like Reefer Madness. <laughs> or what's, what's that one dude from Sponge, SpongeBob? Nosferatus or something? No, that's a silent film. We don't want to watch silent films. Come on. <laughs> it's a high effort reaction, Andy, dude. Etika watched a Death Note movie on stream. Really? But did he? He probably deleted the bot afterward. I don't know. I don't know how Etika watched um, the Death Note movie on stream without getting banned. What the hell? All right, I'm down. Tomorrow, Mario Ma Mario make or not Mario Maker. Tomorrow we can play Mario Party with everyone, and then watch old ass movies. Yeah, spend our night watching movies, dog. <laughs> Although I should probably ask a staff member if that's okay. I mean, I don't see why not. There's no copyright, but let's just make sure, you know. So happy for you. Finally looking out for yourself and progressing in life, not bringing, not being harassed and controlled by Reddit. Kim is the best thing <laughs> to ever happen to you. Love you, man. Thank you, dude. Cock. I appreciate that, homie. So I get paid to watch Ice now? Yes. Sort of. You, you watch, you get paid sparks. Sparks equals money. For me, not for you. But you get to donate for free. Isn't that amazing? Hmm. Oh, it sparks on me, but it doesn't matter. Still, it's still fun. Taunt of the dead. Dude, I'm gonna look up, somebody look up the copyright laws on Google right now. How long, I can't do it on my phone because I'm streaming, but how long does it take for copyright to go away in movies? Somebody just Google that right now. Because then we can, I would love to watch movies that are not from the 1920s. You know, something like in the 80s, that'd be fine. Watch like Predator or something, I don't know. Independence Day. <laughs> Seventy years, seventy-five years. Uh, okay. Seventy. What, how long ago is seventy-five years ago? Let me see. This two thousand nineteen. I don't know math very well. Hundred years was nineteen nineteen. And then plus fifteen. Thirty. Nineteen forty-four. Nineteen forty-four. That's some old bro. Do they even have movies back then? Like, what do you mean? Bro, they only had, like, silent films back then, bro. Like, that's, like... I don't know, that's some weird... I mean, actually, they had, like... I don't know. We'll figure something out. Watch some World War II propaganda. Seventy-five years after the death of the director. Oh, okay. So the guy has to die. All right. Well, that sucks. What does this person say? Hold on. Somebody just messaged me something relating to what we're talking about. Well, I can't see it because my phone is scuffed. Something about partners having movie, movie nights or something. Interesting. I'll, I'll look into it. Yeah, I would love to watch movies. That'd be dope. We're going to watch some movies together. I'm down for it. 
Oh, the Wizard of Oz. There we go. That's the one. Right there. <laughs> we can go. We can see the the, the munchkin in the background. I had a PBR. I can't tell if sometimes the chat repeats itself or if people are just spamming the same thing over and over. And nobody wants to watch that. The Wizard of Oz, baby. What up? Have you learned about reacting to YouTube videos? Uh, I mean, I could react to YouTube videos. I could give my commentary on YouTube videos so people donate. But I mean, what can I possibly say about a YouTube video that has probably already been reacted to before? You know what I mean? I feel like every YouTube video that anyone will send me has already been reacted to by some other streamer. I'd rather react to movies because that, is, that at least brings something unique to the table. What if I could be dead... Okay, you know Dead Meat on YouTube? He's like a... He like reviews like slasher movies, like sort of, and gives like a kill count. What if we did like a like a live version of Dead Meat? Wouldn't that be interesting? I don't know. That could be funny. You should just react to other IRL streamers and critique them and tell them how they could be better. That make I mean I could, but I feel like that'll make me come off like a douchebag or like conceited or something. I've done that before though. I did that with, with Fiji and Andy when he tried to stream. Or when I gave him a stream and I like tried to coach him live. It didn't really and uh, it didn't end up working out. Now what I could react to is reaction streamers. I could react to other reaction streamers reacting to YouTube videos. And I give my commentary on their reactions to the YouTube videos. That would be ridiculous. Realistically, it would just come off like I'm harassing that person, probably. That would, that's a fucking meta, but people would be like, Ace Poseidon, stop harassing my stream. I'd be like, sorry. Smoke two mixer that you have. Yeah, I, I applied for it, dude. I applied for that partnership. Why is your nose running in the middle of summer? It's not. I was itchy. My nose is itchy. That's it. It's not coke. It's not anything like that. It's just my nose is itchy. It's allowed to be itchy. It's like if I itch my neck. No, I don't have fucking herpes in my neck. It's just it's an itch. Brother playing some like old music in here. The Backstreet Boys. How many countries gonna visit in the EU? Uh, I don't know, maybe like 10 or something, 20. I don't, I don't fucking know. Something. I want to go to a good portion. We got three weeks of travel. Good portion, bro. That's funny, dude. Yeah, like I said, where am I going in the EU? The east side, or the west side. Did west you side. get partnered yet? Have not seen you last few days. Give us one of the arm things. I don't know what you're talking about, blue balls. Sorry, dude. Fuck you, dude. Um, no, I don't have partner yet, dude. Unfortunately, you would be able to tell. You would see a button, dude. But, one day. Thank you, dude. I wish I could see the gifts. Y'all are, I'm missing out here. Y'all are having a, a, a blast over there. And I, 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 they need to be, they need to show the gifts on the phone app. All I see is the emotes. I don't see anything else. I see the fucking stickers and all this other shit. That's it. Very good timing. 
can only assume I did the same thing as the Geth at the same time. Yeah, I downloaded the Mixer Create app. It's really bad for IRL streaming. It's only like, it's just, there's no landscape, there's no donations, it's just plain, it's like Periscope, you know? Then in portrait mode, it's pretty bad. Am I going to Rune West? Yeah. It's in like 20 days. So I'll be there. I think Boldest Dad's gonna join me there. So that'll be a nice little thing. I think Boldest Dad's gonna come a week before Rune West and uh, we're gonna hang out and then we're gonna go over together. <laughs> I think GIFs are better content than the stream. Hey. Usually chat is better content than most streams, yes. Chat is like 70% of the entertainment, I feel. No one's gonna watch most streams without a fucking chat room, let's be real. Would you watch somebody watch a YouTube video without chat? No, of course not. That, that's stupid. The only streams that are good without chat are gaming streams if you like the game. Am I going to go stream Area 51? I'll go stream the, the town of Area 51, but there's no internet at Area 51. So, we'll see. I'll get a little RV and we'll go to Area 51. That's September 20th. Oh, wait. Oh, I don't know. That's September 20th. I'm going to Europe September like 8th or something, and then we're going to be there three weeks. I don't know if we'll make it back in time. I've got to. I've got to. I've got to make it back. That's like two and a half weeks. I'll make it back. I don't need to be in Europe for that long. I'll make it back. But I just don't think that. I know there's not going to be internet there. I know there's not. So I would be in the city near it. I wouldn't be in Area 51. But I don't know if the city has internet either because it has like 40 people living there. When I looked it up on the map. So we'll see. Mr. Beast went, yeah, but did Mr. Beast have internet? <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> that would be content in the city, close to it. Yeah, I just hope there's more than one cell phone tower. <laughs> if there's like a shitload of people there. Dress up like an alien? Bro, I'll dress up like an alien, I'll run around and be like, catch me. And somebody will <laughs> shoot me, dude. Think I'm serious. Grow your beard out? No, it's too patchy. It's too patchy to grow out. It doesn't look good. And my mustache is like, half of it will never grow back because I ain't waxed it one day. I like a dumbass. Use the Area 51 base for Wi-Fi? Yeah, that's a great idea, dude. I'll, I'll just go ask Donald Trump to give me the Wi-Fi to Area 51. <laughs> I'll do the only the mustache again. What's with the lady? Uh, I don't know what people are talking about in the background. Just ignoring their conversation. Thank you, ninjas. Appreciate it, dude. You look like an alien. They'll let you in and kill everyone else. Oh, well, hey. As long as I can fit in with the aliens, then I will be able to do my mission of live streaming the aliens in Area 51. I look, I look, I look like one. That's fine with me. I dated one, so I could look like one. You, you know, when you date something long enough, you start looking like it. That's what they say. Yeah, everyone thinks I'm crazy. I don't care. All these people around me think I'm crazy. It's fine. Not really. No one's looking at me. I was mind their own business. Mm. Mm. Is Gray coming with you? Um, well, Gray, I don't know. I think Gray is going to go home uh, after Rune West, so I'm not really sure. Or Gary, maybe. Or Gray, yeah. Uh, Gary's near LA, so he could probably come to Area 51 with me. To be fair. 
Who's on the EU lineup? I mean, I don't know, to be honest. I haven't thought that far ahead into it. But it would just be, uh, it would be, I would want Grimoire. That's, that's what I'll say. That's all I'll say. I would want Grimoire to join me. She's already in Europe. I would want her. Maybe John, maybe John Zerka, but I don't really know. I don't know how he is uh, really that much. I hung out with him one time, so I don't really know how he is. But I know that he's streaming on YouTube, so I don't know. And uh, we were talking in DMs a little bit, but I don't know if we're on the same page, though. <laughs> Whatever that, I know that that really doesn't mean a lot to you guys. You don't know what I'm, what I'm talking about, but I just don't know if we're on the same page type of shit. <laughs> You're number four being watched right now. Oh, top number four being watched. Hey, and all we're doing is sitting eating potato chips. Ain't that amazing? <laughs> Fuck it, dude. Bro, we can turn this platform into the potato chip eating platform. Anyone who comes on here and eat potato chips, you get a host. Everyone who's gonna be on the top of the shit is gonna be eating streams. Okay? We're gonna turn this into the eating platform. Huh. Great. Andy Belvinakis. Hey, Andy. That's that. I saw your tweets about Mix there. Let's go. This is it. Invite Trisha Paytas for dinner. Uh, no, just the bill, please. Thanks. J Pod, bro. I'm not. No, there's who the, no, no fucking J Pod, dude. Enough. So, but because I'm Talk to Greek. <laughs> well, let's be real. Greek would not come on any EU trip. He's, a, you know, he's streaming on Twitch. He has his own thing going on. He's not going to come, come stream with me. You know what I mean? That makes no sense for him. Because he, there's no like, there's not a mutual thing there. It's, it's just like a single thing. Laura wants a tattoo of me? Okay. She, that would be a stupid move. Bring Laura? Fuck no. Fuck no, dude. If, listen, bringing Laura is the only thing that's gonna accomplish is breaking that girl's heart. That's all that would happen. I would, like, she, her heart would be broken because I wouldn't fuck her, you know what I mean? Like, I wouldn't do anything with her. She would, she's in love with me and she wants to fuck and do, and like, marry me and shit. I, if I invite her to Europe, she's gonna be like, oh my god, this is it. But then it's not gonna happen like that. And she's gonna cry again. So that's, that'd, that'd be so weird. <laughs> We're all going to white space, okay? Okay, we're all going to white space. We're all going to white space. Three times. I am not going to get the sauce. I did not block Laura, no. I didn't. <laughs> Apparently, she was talking to a fake me on her chat, and the fake me said that I wanted to marry her, and that's why she came all the way here. And then when I didn't want to marry her, because I don't even really know her, she cried. So I don't know how you can believe a fake me in your chat room. Because I would assume you would be like messaging me on Twitter and stuff. And then when you don't get a reply on Twitter, isn't that weird? 
I don't know. Like, how do you get catfished by somebody who is verified? It just, it's so weird to me. Just, but it's like so weird. Dude. Yeah, she was like sending her pics to that to that catfish, like uh, pics of like her in a in like a thong and shit. And I'm like, I don't. I just feel I, that sucks. I feel bad for her. She just I don't think she gets internet culture. Um. I'm not bringing Kraken, dude. What? No, we're not bringing Kraken, dude. Yeah, I knew even even before it happened. What is what is Kraken? No, no Kraken, dude. And that's exactly what happened. But like, she's cool, right? That wasn't like a fun. Like, she's actually super cool. Take a bomb. Dude. No, take a random homeless guy, dude. Yeah, right. No way. That's gonna be. Just, that'll be awful. That'll be in the news again. That'll be in the news. Our last story was about the Tarzana Mansion in LA with all the homeless people that showed up. Now, said YouTuber bringing homeless people across the country or across the world to Europe. Is it a good thing? I don't know. Is it a bad thing? Who knows? Free healthcare. Could be actually a good thing. Bring homeless people to a place with free healthcare, actually. Think with your head. Help them out. Dude, I still, have, I'm still having problems with that hospital bill that I, when I got my stitches. I've been trying to get that shit, I've been like disputing it, trying to get that shit taken care of. They are being so stubborn. They still want me to pay $8,000 for this hospital bill for stitches when I had insurance. And I'm like, no, I paid $2,500 for my insurance for the year. I'm not paying for these fucking stitches. I've been disputing this shit for months. America, ain't that great? Healthcare is amazing. You have healthcare, they don't even cover it. You're gonna get sued. No, I'm not gonna get sued. I'm disputing it because I had healthcare. I'm like, what the fuck? Just stitched myself. I know, dude. No, not a lawsuit. I'm not ignoring it. I'm just disputing it. What about your community service? Oh, I'm already taking care of that. You don't have to worry about that. That's been done. That, that's done and uh, taken care of. It's just a $4,000 month apartment deposit loss. Oh, great. Another one of those. I haven't already had 10. What'd you get community service for? I snuck into a convention inside of a Fortnite llama and got caught and they gave me community service for trespassing. There's a video online on YouTube if you want to search that up. It's quite good. Totally not worth it though. <laughs> Lucky that's all that happened to me? What do you mean? Dude, I shouldn't have even got community service or trespassing. Because I was never trespassed to begin with, but I didn't want to fight it. So, I just took the community service. I could have fought it, but it would have been just a bunch of lawyer fees. So, I was just like, I'll just take community service. 
Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Let me just keep this down here for a sec. To get the description on mobile, click stream window. Then click banner with Ice Poseidon's name. Links are there. Yes, that is how you do it. I know there's some confusion on mobile, but that is how you do it. Thank you, Mix <laughs> Mixer customer service. Alrighty. Let us go back home. Bro, they're still playing the song on the radio. Riding on a track, all in my blood. Honestly, he has such he has better songs. He has such better songs, dude. First of all, let me make sure the Bluetooth ain't going on right now. There we go. Like it's the song is still number one. <laughs> like homie. First of all, Panini is already a better song than Old Town Road. First of all, how did he even get Billy Ray Cyrus when he was not famous yet? I don't know, but. Panini's a better song, and so is Rodeo. <laughs> and also, there's other better songs than that one to be number one by other artists. So I don't really get it. Ellie Golding is got great songs. They should be number one. Fucking Juice World. You know. Well Nas, he's he's great. You know, I like his Twitter posts, but come on. It's time to get over the fucking Old Town Road. Okay, I'm at a red light right now. <laughs> Cheat up, dude, yeah. Juice World's good, but Ellie, bruh, dude. Well, what's wrong with Ellie? Dude, you're crazy. She's one of the best female singers, dude. You're nuts. Her and Billy, uh, Billy Elish, very good singers. I used to not like a uh, female, like girl, artists because I thought it was so like feminine and like I just thought it was like fucking gay to listen to. But you know, I've grown out of that. I don't think it's gay to listen to female artists. I think. Uh, they're actually good, like very good. Especially when they collab with other uh, like rappers and stuff. Cardi B's not bad. She's not, okay? She's better than Nicki Minaj. I didn't think so ever, but after listening to Clout by Offset, Cardi B's not bad, okay? I think she did really good in that song. I mean, the lyrics mean literally nothing, and, uh, you know, there's no legacy to be had in those lyrics, but the song is really good. She did a good job with uh, rapping it. <laughs> Can't say yikes to that one. Can't say yikes to that. Is Cardi B really just trash, everybody? I don't think she's that bad. I don't know. I mean... She's not ideal, you know, and most songs I would not prefer her in. And I don't, I'm not going to listen to her music by herself, but when she's featured by some people, she's good. It's like a 10 minute drive home. Bill Cosby, dude. Bill Cosby is never a singer. Unless we're talking about something else that I'm just not getting right now. I can't really reach out right now, so just bear with me. We'll be home in like 10 minutes. Yeah, some guy in this chat, he did say, uh, Austin seems boring. It's really not. I mean, it's really not. 
it's a fun place to live. It's just, uh, I mean, it's not as, there's not as many events going on like in LA, but it's very nice to live. It's a lot of convenience, 24 hour stuff, nice places, good music. There's just not a lot of, uh, things happening in it. <laughs> Fuck it, dude. Yo, dude, can you get rid of the fucking ASCIIs? The ASCIIs are fucking annoying. They're taking up the whole chat on my phone. <laughs> like, literally the whole chat is a f my fucking face, ASCII. And it's the worst face, too. I hate that face. So stupid. I wish I never made that face. It was from the stream with fucking Haley, dude. Or after Haley and Geisha. That whole nonsense. I hate it. <laughs> I wish it would delete itself off the internet. One advice I can give to any streamer ever, try not to uh, cry on stream because people will meme that for eternity at some point. Uh, I mean, if that if you're like a meme kind of, if you're like the meme crowd at least, if you're like Lyric or somebody, you probably wouldn't get memed, but if you're in the meme crowd, get ready to get memed for life. <laughs> Crying is manly, dude. Yeah, I mean, it is, to be honest. To be able to show emotions like that is quite manly. Walmart? No, we're not going to Walmart. There's nothing There's nothing to buy at Walmart. Nothing to do at Walmart. Um, you know, if the Mario Party works tomorrow, then I'll just get the shit set up before the stream. Uh, otherwise... You know, I don't know. It's either Houston or, or that tomorrow. Either Houston or Mario Party tomorrow. That's that's what could happen. I kind of actually want to do the Mario Party. We all drink, play the game. It's always fun. But I don't know. We'll see where we end up. the Xbox. I mean, I don't want to buy the Xbox right now. I'll buy the Xbox tomorrow. Or something. Or whenever I feel like I want to do the shared controller thing. I mean, we could do that at any point, honestly. Um, I want to look online first. I don't want to buy the Xbox from Walmart right now. I want to look online first. Because I think there could be better options for me online for buying it. Oh, let me uh, put this down real quick. Hold up. To give me a sec. Can't see the chat right now, sorry dudes. Just give me a second. We're almost there. Is it fucking raining outside? Why in the fuck? It rains here so much, dude. Probably like three times a week at least. 
clearly it doesn't rain in LA at all. <laughs> Are you the real ice? If so, what made you switch to Mixer? Hello there. What is your name, Greasy? Greasy. Uh, yes, I am the real ice. Or his twin brother. Um, I'm just trying it out. I mean, I've been streaming on, I've been streaming on YouTube for a couple years now, and I wanted to try to mix her out because YouTube is kind of shit. <laughs> so we're giving it a week trial here and see what happens. But thank you, dude. I appreciate that, homie. with me while I lock the door. <laughs> oh, never mind. I'm stupid. I'm a stupid ass. Awesome. I love your content. You are the MVP of IRL streamers. Thank you, Greasy. I appreciate that, homie. Thank you so much, dude. Poor fucking robot Andy, dude. There he is. All right, yo. Fucking show the robot. Yo, it's just the robot. I don't even know if that site is still going on. If the site's probably still active, why wouldn't it be? Motherfucking robot Andy. ABC shit. You better be careful. Snoopy likes to chew up shoes. He'd be gonna slap Snoopy if his shoes got chewed up there. All right, well, I'm gonna end the stream here. Thank you all for watching. Sorry, Mario Party did not work out. Twitch appeal when? <clears throat> uh, I already appealed like, uh, like three months ago. So I'm still waiting on that. Which sounds like a long time, but it's Hyphonics. It took him many months to get a reply, so it doesn't matter. Um, yo, I'm going to see y'all later. Fucking Mario Party either tomorrow or Houston. One of the two. We'll see what ends up happening. Um, with that being said, let's host somebody here. Let's see who's on. Let's see who to host. So I was watching the guy I hosted yesterday. <laughs> he, uh, he got hosted, and then the viewers dropped in, like, 20 minutes. That was so bad. But then again, he had no webcam, so, you know, and if, you know, if you don't know him, why would you watch if you have no webcam? I don't even know who to host, dude. It's just like, let's see, IRL section, what do we got? There's not much going on here. This is girl. Love advice. Only content on Mixer. What is this? <laughs> what is this, dude? All right, let's host this guy. He seems funny. His title is Only Content on Mixer. So I'll see y'all later. All right, peace. And love you guys. And goodbye. <laughs>